And now, ladies and gentlemen, uh, from the Department of Peace Initiative, who actually instigated this ceremony at uh, City Hall for the last four years, I would like uh, to uh, ask Saul Arbus to just come up and, and talk a little bit about the Department of Peace Initiative. Logical. Welcome, friends, everyone that has come to this memorable day, this joyful day of celebration for what peace is and what peace means to all of us as we gather with friends and families to make this a stunning example of peace by peaceful means. We stand at a crossroads as our species has so damaged the earth because we war against the planet as we war against ourselves. We can do better. We must do better. We need to rise to our maturity as the peoples of this earth, one planet, one people. And we can do this. We will do this. And this is where the idea of a Department of Peace in all nations comes from. We need a new architecture of peace that overcomes the architecture of war, which is so easily mobilized, as we're seeing in the current crises around the world. Who speaks for peace in our government? Who speaks for peace in the federal cabinet? No one speaks for peace. We need a minister dedicated to the transformation of conflict by peaceful means, that all issues of peace and security that come before cabinet are seen through the lens of the culture of peace, both at home and abroad. We can do this. We will do this. We will do this through this immense and profound and inspiring groundswell of support that all of the people of the earth are seeking. Since, all, since time immemorial, the primary goal and aspiration of all people in all time is to live in peace and harmony with their neighbors. And Victoria is really a good example of this. And we're expressing that today. And I want to say a special welcome to the youth who are here today, from Pearson College and the children all the way down to maybe three years old. People often say, People often, often say to children, to youth, they say, you are the future. No, that is not right. You are the now. You are the present. You are the inspiration that will lead to change among the reluctant adults that many of us are. We can do this. We will do this. May peace prevail in your homes, in your communities, and all or through the nations. May peace prevail on earth and may it begin with us. Thank you.